Can't get it down. Welcome back, everyone. This is a special episode of Keeping It Eat with Derek and Nick. I'm Nick, certified bartender. Derek, certified bourbon steward. And you know what, Derek? We've been asked to do these little five minute segments of just fun little things, and we thought today, let's do the discussion of nips. Nips! And we aren't talking about nips. No, we're talking about <laughs> nips. So, let's get into it. The one thing I really could go for right now, there's no way I'm gonna say it. I would love a nip in my mouth right now. I would love a nipperkin in my mouth. Nipperkin? I've nipperkin. never heard it used as that term. A Let me tell you a little bit about nipperkin. Right. Nipperkin is an old British term yep. for a small cup or a vessel. All right. So, basically what ended up happening was in the United States, we call nips. I'm using my notes. Notes. <laughs> and a nip is usually considered about a mini bottle of alcohol, usually about 50 milliliters, milliliters. there about. There you go. So, uh, it's a single serving. In Scotland and Northeast USA, you, uh, we all call them nor um, nips. However, most of the world calls them airplane bottles. And now, interesting enough, really? apparently most places are trying to ban these because of public drunkenness and littering. How many of these do you have to drink to have public drunkenness? I mean... A sleeve. So just to put it in perspective, <laughs> just to put it in perspective, I know that Dr. McGillicuddy's, their brand of, they're not bourbon, <laughs> their brand of liqueur um, goes for a sleeve for 10 bucks usually. How many okay? is in there? Uh, I believe it's I believe it's like ten for ten almost. Mm. Three, two, four, six, Bargain, eight, buck a piece. I think so. Yeah. Um, now, when you get a sleeve of Jameson or one of the nicer ones that we own, yeah, here, these are a little more. It's pricey. gonna be a little bit different. Yeah. We have a sleeve of those. I right? want to say because I think some of these were like two ninety nine. Yeah. So you get a sleeve. You're depending. paying like twenty thirty bucks yeah. a sleeve. So, anyways. Um, we just wanted to give you this little tidbit. Little tidbit, little nip of knowledge nip for you. Nip of knowledge. That's going to be the, I think that's what we're going to call this segment, nip of knowledge. Nip of knowledge. Because I just like, like the word nip. Nip, nip, nip. So what nip do you want, Nick? Hmm. <laughs> nip and Nick. I like we it. should do a blind pick. Boy, you, how, how do we? <laughs> Put them all in and we just got to reach in and grab something. You know what? They're all not going to fit. They're not all going to fit. So this and is, even if I shake it's them. It's going to shake them. It's not going to work. We can just grab what we really wanted. But now I'm going to grab something randomly that's on top because it hasn't moved. So here I go, not looking. Reaching in. And there I got mine. I'm going to put my fingers down a little. Going deep. What you got? Doers. Doers. All right. I got a little Which Mr. I have Jack drink of choice at a wedding recently. Old Jack number seven is what I'm going with. We're going to do the actual airplane, airplane crack. There it is. There it is. Cheers, Cheers mate. sir. Are you ready to whiskey? Ready and able, babe. We were ready. <laughs> ready and able, babe. I like it. You know what? The more we drink, the more the closer we get. Who knows? We may have way more nips on this show than you've ever I expected. Can't. I was way too yeah. funny. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. We'll talk to you soon. <laughs> if you are ready and able to whiskey, be sure to drop a comment below. Hit those like and subscribe buttons and press notifications. Also, follow Keeping It Neat on Instagram. Thanks for watching, kinfolk.